Design Challenge is an international competition which has seen a group of Year 7 students from a Melbourne high school become world champions. With a prize pool of $1.5 million, we thought we'd take a look. <laughs> Nowadays, technology influences every part of our lives. Today we're at the national final for the School's Innovation Design Challenge. It's held at the Telstra Innovation Centre in Melbourne. Let's go check it out. Today is a very important day. There's been 120 high schools busy all year. They're here showcasing their projects in um, racing of their cars, presenting their uh, folios to a team of judges and also verbal presentations. A massive improvement. I think that is one because it's Hi, Westingers, Trinity Grammar and Q. We design mock Formula One cars uh, using a CNC machine with Dassault Systems program Cartier. Cartier is a state-of-the-art program, the best in the world, basically. It allows us to construct something virtually. We could test it with the structural analysis to test for weaknesses and what's the strength on the car. We could find if there were any problems with the design. From there we just started developing uh, test models and uh, testing them and evaluating them. Uh, the car, as you can see, we were basing it on uh, the best possible streamlining, uh, as you can see on the underneath. We have that to create lift and we've also got a bottom spoiler at the back which uh, makes it streamlined back onto the racetrack. That's the parabola. When the CO2 shoots out, it hits those walls and comes back into the jet stream. It literally flies along the track. OK, here we are at the final race for this Design Innovations Challenge. So how you feel, guys? Uh, pretty pumped. Yeah. ready? Ready down there? We could win. And got the I got the magic thumb, which thumb. could fire it off at the right time. Yeah. It is equal the world record to one thousandth of a second. The result is that the Stingers have won the knockout competition. It's just totally awesome. The way is sevens, we didn't think we were going to win. So what's the plans next? We're going to be competing in the world championships. Well, going to England and uh, taking out the title for Australia. Having taken out the national championships, the Stinger team of Melbourne are off to Europe for the world championships. The guys are competing with 17 teams from 13 countries to take out a $1.5 million prize pool. I was very tense because the suspense was just so great. The Malaysians, uh, because they took um, Boss's car, were expecting them to win. The world champions are came up on the screen and the stingers appeared and we were like, that's a mistake. Surprise was the very big thing because we didn't think we'd win. Like, uh, and then there was just a sort of explosion. And I thought, man, I've got to really put, put, put on a performance, so I chuck this Charlie flag on my back. Before I started, uh, I was just thinking, um, how does someone make an object? Now, I know how they make that object. We've got the university scholarship, so I could really see myself doing designing, engineering sort of thing in the future. It's opened up so many possibilities. The final thing I'm going to say is I think this is the best competition in the world. We're the Stingers from Trinity Grammar School Q in Melbourne and you're watching School Talk. Talk.